Hey gang, yeah, it's Zanny J here. Yeah, my uh, new neon sign just arrived. I thought it was going to be sent to the FedEx drop-off at Walgreens over here, but I heard a bump, like a knocking at the door, then I got a message. It dropped it off. But yeah, here it is. I'm going to open it up. We're going to see. Yep, there it is. It says, let's get weird. If you can all see that or not. Let's get weird. But yeah, that's pretty cool, man. I think I'll put this one up in here. And I've got the other two out there. I'm kind of trying to spread them out throughout the apartment. Yeah, I'm slowly unpackaging it. I'm trying to make sure it's um, you know, not damaged. I'm just going to take my time. You know, because this is a glass product. <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna look pretty cool once it's lit up. So I think I just want to put, I want to keep this one in here because I got the others in the other room. I kind of want to spread them out. I just think it would be cool. You have at least one or two in here. Ugh. Excuse me. As you can see, I've got most of the foam out now. I'm not trying to make this a long, drawn-out video. I'll, I'll speed it up where I think it's applicable. Yeah, it's definitely not something I want to try to mess with when I, if I'm a little buzzed off some wine or something. <laughs> but yeah, that's what it looks like right there. I'm going to go ahead and... Hey, Rowdy. Rowdy's saying hey. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to do a test plug-in just to see how it looks before I put it on the wall. I'm just going to check it over and everything. Oh, somebody had already turned the switch on. Yeah, it's it's like a it's purple. It says let's get weird. <laughs> well yeah. That's what she'd be looking like. Well everybody I actually got it all put up finally. Get close to it to really see it again. I know you saw it in the box, but yeah, it's up there. Hey, a little update, gang. Um, <clears throat> I had a mishap with my sign. When I had it up on the wall, right, because it was working fine at first, and I put it up on the wall, and then after like five, ten minutes, it suddenly cut out to where some of the letters were barely showing, so I shook it around to get the mercury flowing. Still couldn't figure it out, so I said, well, it may be some of the connections. So I was going to take the rubber uh, insulator off of there, and I inadvertently broke the, one of the neon, tu the neon tubing for the LETs. I thought, well, I could send it back to them, but I'm like, I don't have, I'd have to go through all the trouble of shipping that. And I initially put it, I said, I'm just going to put it in the dump, quietly just put it in the dumpster and order a different one, which I've ordered a different one that says, let's get weird. But I thought, well, that's the only part that's broken, so I could just take the lets off of there and just have it say, get weird. This whole situation's weird if you ask me, but, you know. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's like they say, when life throws you a lemon, make lemonade. It's all about your attitude. If you have the right attitude, the facts don't matter, because you know what? This kind of stuff happens to everybody. You, me, everybody. So I'm like, I'm going to see how this works out. I'm going to leave it on for a while and see what happens. <laughs> You know, it's very important, you know, to be, and I've looked at this in tutorials, be very careful because that glass is fragile. <laughs>
that's the only one that's one of the drawbacks of a neon sign you got to be really careful with that but hopefully it works out for me as always stay blessed stay safe and stay healthy in the name of christ peace out